This was Tessa Gobo's day, back at her old stomping grounds at Chesterfield School. It was a day filled with meeting new young friends and sharing Olympic stories. Everybody just like started freaking out and everybody was um, so excited. It was exciting. I didn't know that I would actually like see her in person. It it was unbelievable. Unbelievable because only a few weeks ago, this was Gobo in Rio competing and winning at the Olympics. Her Team USA Women's 8 took the gold medal, which she brought back to show her hometown. Even though she shared stories of rowing, she said she just wanted to leave a message that would inspire the students. I mean, it's not even about rowing at this point. It's just about, you know, thinking about what your dreams are and doing your best to fulfill them. And I really feel like the bigger the dream, the better, because if it doesn't work out, they're still going to end up with some cool stuff. Gobo and her family spent the day taking photographs for the yearbook and answering many questions from the young fans. But the big surprise? That this will always be Tessa Gobo Day at the school. I I can't believe it. I'm not I mean, the gold medal's cool, but I'm not sure I deserve a day, but it's fun. I'm having a good time. So I'm glad they organized it. Tessa Gobo says she's not sure yet if she's going to make another run at the Olympics. She's made quite a few media rounds after Rio, so at least for now, she's just enjoying some home time and certainly some family time here in Chesterfield. Naoko Funayama, WMUR News 9.